Good evening, folks. Uh, Amit here from Cardboard Culture. And while we're taking breaks from doing interviews, Kent and I are busting packs, boxes, and, and various things. Sometimes we bust packs, sometimes we bust boxes. Tonight, I'm going to take you to three three packs of Upper Deck uh, uh, Spider-Man Homecoming. So I'll tell you more in detail like I usually do. So I, as I always refer to Cardboard Connection. So I'm going to go over this product here. So I'm going to get right into the product, uh, what they look like. So Spider-Man Homecoming autograph, you get stuff like this, Michael Keaton. That'd be a really cool hit. Um, doesn't look to be a sticker auto from what I see, uh, but I could be wrong. It could be just a placement, but hoping they're hard sign, hard sign, but won't know. So let's go over in detail. Um, 2017 Upper Deck Spider-Man Homecoming contains several premium hits per box. Actor autograph of the stars of Spider-Man Homecoming in single and dual form. It's a single and dual autograph memorabilia and spider booklet cards. So this is actually really cool. The singles go to 100 and the duels go to 10. So let's see. In all the Marvel products that Upper Deck produces, there's always sketch cards. Um, again, the struggle I have with sketch cards are that I don't always know the artist. I'm getting better at it, but it's hard to, to figure out who's who. Um, other hits are web threads memorabilia. That's actual actual relic pieces from used in the film. Two per hobby box and offer single, dual, triple, quad options. Now, see, it doesn't really do a good job of telling you what else is in here. But let's go to the set checklist. So the set checklist is, this is the way the card looks, right? Got a very Spider-Man themed web slinger background to it. And it's got the web in the back. So there's, um, you'll have the uh, silver foil, which are looks like it's uh, five to six. Uh, if you had to read this, this is like a five in every hobby box and six in every uh, EPAC uh, bo- a break. And then it's a red foil, blue foils, and black foils all numbered. And of course, this is through the oh, and then there's a spider sightings pack uh, as well as one in every three and a five packs. Uh, queens to screen. So um, we have uh, there's like some of the characters in here that are in in here, right? So, Bokeem Woodbine, Michael Chernis, Logan Marshall, Laura Harrier, uh, Jacob Batalon, Tony Revolori, Michael Mando, Hannibal Barrett, Kenneth Choi, Martin Starr, Abraham Atta, Michael Barberi, Garcelle Bove, Delanis Leva, JJ Tota, Anguri Rice, and Michael Keaton. So, Michael Keaton, obviously the big one, but you'll notice in this product, we're missing uh, two or three key people. Um, one of them being Spidey himself and uh, Spidey's Aunt May. And forgetting the name of the actress right now, but she's famous from when I was in the 80s. So, to be quite honest with you, I'm only really looking for a Michael Keaton auto, if anything, but the rest of it, not really. There's nothing in here that really uh, makes me, you know, uh, sing a tune that I want. So, there's a Queen to Screen uh, dual autograph. So, you can see Bokeem Woodbine, Michael Turner, Selena, S. Abraham. Logan and Michael, Tony and Jacob, Michael Keaton and Bokeem Woodbine. That'd be interesting. I'll prefer to get the Michael single. The JJ Toda, Abraham Mata, uh, Garza Bobe, Laura Harrier, Kenneth and Martin, uh, Kenneth and Hannibal Spurrus, and Martin Starr and Hannibal Burris. So this is an example of one of the autographs right here. Um, my wife uh, really likes this character. He actually does a really good job in the movie. Um, and uh, I think he's, he's a He's just a fun character. He's kind of like the guy next door and everyone knows, right? His name is Jacob Batalon. Um, I don't know how to say it properly, but I'm thinking that's the proper way to say it. I'm just going to go on mute real quick because I'm going to sneeze. Pardon that. So let's just go through. This the, This is what the dual autographs look like. Not bad. I mean, like I said, I'm not really looking forward to the autograph parts of this, but I'll tell you why. There's the web uh, threads. So this is the kind of like mem used from the Spidey suits. That's something cool I wouldn't mind hitting. So here are the different types you can hit, right? Um, web threads dual memorabilia. And then web threads triple memorabilia. There's the web quad memorabilia. Web single thread dual autograph memorabilia. Uh, the dual autograph memorabilia. Again, I'm really only looking for um, one auto. So I'm really not, you know, enthralled by those. Uh, behind the lens checklist. This is just uh, kind of a parallel set. 
It's a Civil War images checklist. You can see there's different items here. Friend of Foe, uh, Spider Tech uh, checklist, uh, Decathlon. And as I mentioned before, there's a sketch artist. Now, the artist sketch card really only do well if they're, the art is, is really is really tight, like really, really nice looking artwork. Um, just kind of like a black and white, kind of like not really that special of an art card. It doesn't go for as much value. Um, you can see all the artists here. And that's pretty much it. Uh, I think there are some other inserts it's not mentioning, but let me double check here. I feel like it's missing uh, a couple of inserts. I could have sworn there's some pink uh, or mauve colored uh, precious metal gems in here. But I could be wrong. Anyway, uh, the reason I brought you here is I'm going to break two packs. So here's the packs I'm going to break. And uh, one thing I will do here is, and I haven't done here, there is the hobby exclusive uh, EPAC parallels you can get. Sorry, there, is, there are the EPAC specific parallels you can get. I didn't cover that here. Um, but you can actually go to read the on, the, on the store. Actually, let's just go do it. Let's go to the buy packs. I'll tell you what it is. Let's not be lazy. I'll tell you what it is. One second. Go to Marvel. More info. So the exclusives here. Uh, collect and combine any 10 copies of individual Spider-Man, homecoming base set, spider sighting, on-card EPAC. You receive an EPAC exclusive green fold parallel with the ability to have physical card mailed to you. Collect 10 copies of any individual Spider-Man, homecoming green foil, base set, uh, spider sightings included on the upper deck EPAC. Receive an EPAC exclusive gold foil parallel of that card and have the ability to have it mailed to you. Collect and combine 10 copies of individual Spider-Man Homecoming Web Silver Web Parallel on Upper Deck EPAC. I receive an EPAC Silver Fold Parallel to have that card mailed to you as well. There are the odds in here. I want to mention any of the other inserts that I didn't see in Cardboard Connection. One sec here. Yes, there is. See? This is what I was looking for. So this wasn't mentioned on Cardboard Connection when I was reading it, but the this is what I now this is the hit. So besides the autograph of uh, Michael Keaton. I want to get the precious metal gem purple. So it's one in every 47 packs. So not too bad. Um, and then there's also some printing plates. But really, you see either the mem cards, um, the the autograph of Michael Keaton, or these PMGs of uh, hopefully Spider Man. So we'll see. I don't know what the checklist is, but let's go do it, shall we? So let's go to here, open my packs. Just gonna put you on mute real quick. Excuse me a second. All right, let's do this. Open. Let's see what I get. Uh, let's see. This, this, these are just the base cards. Nothing to write home about. There's Spidey himself. And there's the, the parallel. And then we got a insert here. And I'll just go quickly look at it. This is behind the lens insert. Actually, I don't know if it tells you anything behind. Let me just look at it. Uh, flip it over. Flip it over. Um, the film crew moves in tight to film. The conversation between Happy Hogan, Peter Parker, and Tony Stark. Would have been really nice if any of these three were had autographs in there, but Robert Downey Jr. is impossible to get. I can tell he's hard to get, and so is John Favreau, uh, Tom Holland as well. So that's kind of a mess. But it's hard for Upper Deck to get everyone in the set. Gonna have to deal with rights from Disney, rights from Marvel. It's not an easy thing to do. But as a collector, I can at least admit that I'm disappointed. There's a couple of really cool artwork cards, sorry, base cards in here. By the way, this product is really old. I believe it was released in 20, when was Homecoming out? 2016, 2017? I can't remember. And then there's more there's Tom Holland. So that pack had nothing to write about. Let's go to the next one. Let's see, let's see, let's see what I get. Let's see, let's see. So we've got an insert, another parallel, another base card, another base card, another base card. Oh, I got an insert. Let's see what you got here. Let's flip this guy over. 
Yep, this is the I forgot the name of the insert, but SM3. This is I don't flip over. This is the I forget the name of this insert. But it says Spider Man. There's a bunch of different variants of part of Spider Man. Okay, one more pack. Let's see, can I do this? Come on, PMG. Let's get a PMG. Okay, one, two. Oh, I got a mem card. That's not bad. That means I'm not getting a PMG. Let's keep going. Keep going. Civil War insert card. Oh, I got a. I thought I got a number card. We'll check that in a second. Michael Keaton, but not the card I was looking for. So let's look at this real quick. So this is pretty cool. So this is one of the mem cards, right? Of uh, called Web Thread. So I got the single. And it shows you, you congratulations, we received a card with a piece of Marvel Spider-Man Homecoming memorabilia. This memorabilia is certified to have been used as part of production of Marvel Spider-Man Homecoming movie. So it's 2017, by the way. I can't remember the year. So there you go. Is that? And then let's go see what this other glowy is doing. Turn around. Is this a numbered one? It is. It's numbered to 199. But it's a base parallel number 199. If it was a Spidey one, it would have been uh, amazing. But Oh, well, what can you do? And then this is the card. I wanted to get an autographed version of this guy. He plays Vulture, I believe, in the movie. Vulture? Yeah, Vulture. So, you know what? Not bad, not bad. I have a feeling these mem cards are going to go up in value. These I'm not sure about. Actually, there's one more answer here. Let me check. Let me just check. Oh, it's flipping the wrong way. Let's go this way. Uh, this was the Civil War insert. Okay, so it's a Civil War insert. Nothing crazy in here. Anyways, there you go. You have it, folks. That's the three-pack break of Spider-Man uh, Homecoming. So, I was hoping, hoping to hit a PMG, Spidey PMG or something. But, you know, beggar can't be tutors. I'm so happy with them, man. Peace. Enjoy our breaks.